Hi, I'm Robert, Product Manager at Skyfire, and I'm very excited to show to you Skyfire for iPad. When we launched Skyfire for iPhone, we got a lot of great feedback, and one consistent item was that we need to bring the Skyfire experience as well to the iPad. After a couple of weeks of hard work, we finally arrived at a good point, and we're excited to share it with you. What can you expect? Well, at the top, you have all the standard browsing functions that you can expect now on your iPad. We included as well what we have on the iPhone, the private browsing function, as well as the ability to load pages in different modes. And in addition to that, we have a full screen option as well. Very handy. In addition, we asked ourselves, what can Skyfire bring to the table beyond enabling flash video? And it was clear to us that we tried to make the browsing experience on the iPad more fun, more connected, and most of all, effective. And this is where our quick view functions come in. So what's quick view? Well, here we have our Facebook quick view. It just brings you to your Facebook wall within the browser. So it allows you to, connect, to catch up with your friends and with a post from your friends without having to open up a dedicated app, without having to navigate to Facebook itself as well. Very handy and I can interact with it as well. Ross posted about a Christmas party. I like the party. Let me like it here. Awesome. James shared, uh, it seems, a clip from South Park. So let me just follow up on that and open the new tab. Same mechanism extends as well to Twitter, where I can actually look at my Twitter feeds just with a click away. And it's exactly the same concept as well for Google Reader. Oh, don't allow. For Google Reader, which is a great way of aggregating feeds from across the internet and I use it several times a day. Quickly go through the content, skip through the one that you don't like, and it's just very quick to check up on things. And if you want to follow up, well, just open it up in a new tab. What else is there? Well, we have Fireplace. Fireplace is a more focused Facebook because it only shares the links from your friends. So this is a great starting off place for exploring the internet. So here Brad shared something on CNN. Let me just follow up on that link. And as I'm on CNN, it's a great way of showing as well our popular feature. Popular shows you off the site that you're currently on, CNN in this example, all the links that have been shared by your or my friends in this instance and by the Facebook community in general. So here I see shared interests and here I see what is really hot on that site right now as it has been shared on Facebook. So it's really great to see what's actually going on on CNN beyond what you may see on the home page. Another fantastic feature is the universal like button. We integrated like right into the browser. So on any page on the internet, you can just like it right away. It's just a click away, very simple. Very simple as well is our sharing functionality. So we have lots of different ways that you can actually share the information that you find on your browser with your friends or actually with yourself so that you can actually check, them up, check up on things at a later time. What else? Well, let's look back at the page that we opened earlier. Here we are in South Park. One of the problems with this page is that it actually does not allow you to view this content on the iPad because it requires the flash player. This is again where Skyfire comes in. Skyfire, when you tell it to, processes this page on its servers, looks for plugins, looks for video content, and it finds the video content, it actually starts to process it, extract it, and reformat it in a way that it can actually be displayed on your iPad. So it's a lot of work going on and a lot of expertise going into that. But the result of that is, as you can see, that you can get South Park and other flash video content on your iPad in its full glory. <laughs> there you go. We hope you enjoy it as much as we do. Here we go. Skyfire for the iPad. Thanks.